A dominating effort by UCF tonight. The Knights put 96 points on the board and defeat Tulsa by the final of 96 to 52. A record setting night in a lot of ways for UCF. 17 threes, most in program history. CJ Kelly joining us here to talk about it. CJ, you had a couple of those. What, what was it like offensively tonight? Because everything was working. Um, we, we just shit a ball. We shed a ball. We don't want the ball to stick. We just, we, what we shoot for is dunks, open threes, open shots. Nothing contested, no tough twos. Let's move the ball and play as a team. We feel like when we get up and down in transition, get easy buckets, that's when we're at our best. CJ, talk about how not committing turnovers attributed to being able to get those three-point shots up. Because you guys always shoot a good percentage of the field. It's just taking care of the ball. Tell me how that helped you shoot the ball well tonight. Taking care of the ball is everything. Um, we're still a fairly new team. So, you know, we still have some building to do. But taking care of the ball eliminates um, the other team's transition because we have a great def half-court defense. And also, it just shows we're making connecting plays. Absolutely. We talked about sharing the ball. 28 assists tonight. That, that is a monster number. And I <laughs> see you with the fist pump. That's something that makes you really happy. Yes, because I think that's going to be our highest one of the year for sure. Coach gets on us all the time that we have a bunch of great players, and there's no reason why we should be averaging getting 10 assists a game or single digits. You know, we should be getting 20 plus assists a game. So the fact that we weren't and that we, we're working towards that now it shows a tremendous, um, tremendous shout out to our coaches who work with us every day and to the guys who's um, being brought in. You guys have been struggling defensively a little bit here the last five or six games, and early in the game tonight it wasn't particularly good the first four minutes but after that we tightened up and were terrific yeah another thing that the coaches man we work on that uh, we feel like we should be um top 25 defensive teams in the country and you know we've been through a couple of injuries but we're getting back in our groove heading the right direction you know we feel like we, we should be that team that everyone everyone knows about so right now we feel like we're the dominant of dirt and we like it that way austin i mean excuse me CJ, last piece real quick. Talk to me about Poo War Kuniko real fast. One word. What's Poo like off the court as a teammate? Charismatic. <laughs> Charismatic. War Kuniko showing a little yo-yo dribble. What do you think of this here? Oh, my God. Yes. Yo, we went crazy on the bench. Oh, my God. Yeah, I don't even know. We, we playing one-on-ones, and Poo's that guy. Like, we got we don't play around with him yep. because he will embarrass you if you play around. <laughs> so, yeah, Poo, Poo can go. Poo can go, man. CJ, great stuff. Congratulations. Yeah. Good yeah. luck at Memphis yeah. on yeah. Thursday. Yeah. CJ yeah. Kelly in double figures tonight hit two of UCF's 17 threes, a new program record as the Knights annihilate Tulsa by the final of 96 to 52. Up next for UCF, a trip to Memphis for a big matchup on Thursday night.